in the desert. It's a fight for survival. David Benavidez returns to his hometown Phoenix to prove why he's one of boxing's most feared fighters. A maestro at work. But David Lemieux can strike at any moment. And it's all David Lemieux. It's a Southwestern showdown between two of the 168 pound divisions most wanted. As he is on the receiving end of an onslaught by Benavidez. Benavidez versus Lemieux in a duel between former champions on Showtime. Right after the fight ended, you went to the apron. You were speaking in Errol's direction. Was that yeah. targeted at Errol, or <laughs> who are you speaking to? Uh, most definitely. Um, I'm number one in the IBF now, so uh, like I said, it's time to go fishing. I was actually uh, talking to Cameron Duncan after the fight uh, regarding your future, and Errol Spence was right next to me. I asked Errol Spence if he's going to be fighting you, and he just told me Crawford. So considering that you might – be the second coming of Terrence Crawford, trying to find people who might want to fight you. How do you see your career moving forward and getting those big-time fights that you need to have a star-making performance? Uh, first, of all, I ain't, first of all, I ain't the second coming of nobody. Uh, I got my own style, my own swag. You know, uh, but, uh, you know, uh, about, like, like I said before, if he, don't, if he don't fight Crawford, I'm here. You know, uh, and I'll definitely take the fight. You know, uh, I'm ready, to, I'm ready to continue to keep showing these guys down the best world to in the world. Hey, Mike Hoppinger with ESPN. Congrats, uh, Jaron Ennis. Thank you. Amazing performance again. Um, what do you think it's going to take for you to get the big fight? Obviously, you're at a point right now where guys aren't in a rush to fight you. Um, you're going to be the mandatory, and they'll get a title, it seems, one way or another. Mm -hmm. But what, is there anything you think you can do in particular to I'm, try to make it easier? I mean, I'm with Showtime now. I feel like the big fight is, you know, uh, Set in stone now. Uh, I'm, I'm here, you know, uh, and I feel like a big fight is is next. And, you know, I'm going to continue to keep fighting, like, big-name fighters and stuff like that from here on out. You know, it, it feels like people don't talk about you enough as a power puncher, but you're mm -hmm. getting guys out of here pretty quick over and over and over. And Clayton was a guy that showed pretty good defense in a lot of his past fights. Yeah, uh, he was, uh, you know, a durable guy. I, th I actually thought he was going to get up from the shot, you know, uh, but I guess my new name, the Revolver. <laughs> <laughs> so Six shots. Could you be listed as one of the biggest punchers in boxing? Uh, if y'all want to, I mean, you know, I, it speaks for itself, you know. Um, look at my knockout percentage. Chris. <laughs> <laughs> I got it. Yo, I got it. You're already catching flies. Anybody else? Keith? Catch a bull with your teeth. What? <laughs> what? Uh, Jerron, in the back here, uh, Keith Heidi from BoxingScene.com. Oh, I see. Congratulations, man. Thank you. I appreciate um, it. You're welcome. Did, how do you expect it to be now moving forward in that you're the mandatory, but uh, Spence is obviously going to fight Crawford or the, expected to fight Crawford next, and most people are not going to want to fight you after what they saw again tonight. How do you expect to, to get opponents to get into the ring with you after what you did tonight? I mean, uh, like I said before, I mean, like I said before, uh, I got a showtime behind me. You know, I feel like uh, we can get these big-name fights and – as long as the money talks, I think they're going to get in that ring. So, you will see, you know. Tell them, Bozy. Yeah. Oh, I got something to say. Go ahead. <laughs> um, talk to uh, Stephen. Um, he was saying um, if we don't get the, the title shot from Spence, we uh, probably will fight Thurman if he give up the titles, you know, for the titles. And if we don't get him, we're going to wind up fighting Stenionis. So, one of them got to fight him. Sooner or later, so yeah, you know, and, and it should be pretty soon. Bozy, yeah. would you would you expect Thurman to really entertain the idea of fighting your son? I don't know. A lot of these guys, they, I mean, they say they'll fight him, and then they, next thing you I, know, they they fight somebody else. I, I think he, I think he'd do it because but he, he got to get back into the picture. Not know? only that, though, it, uh, it's for the titles. Yeah. So if it's for the titles, I think he, I think he will take a chance for the titles. You know what I mean? Other than that, he wouldn't. You know?